Hi guys, I don't even know where to begin this video, but I'm going to start at the beginning. This is all about a very, very special guy, who you all know, Chris Travis, who passed away this week. And I know there is hundreds and hundreds of people are throwing tri tributes in all over the place. Everybody's doing their own little video, their own comments, and I can't stand by and not do that myself. Because Chris, personally to me... I've always said he was like the nemesis wrestler, the one guy that I always wanted to meet and never got the chance to, and it took me a while. And thanks to Georgie, who you all know, she managed to make it happen for me. And I met Georgie, I got photos with him, I got autographs, and then obviously the bad news, he got diagnosed with cancer. And um, through that, I actually got to meet him. I was lucky enough to interview him when I did the um, the show Boys on Tour with Gavin Gavin Ox Fletcher. And he he was so humble. Even with everything that was going on in his life, he took the time. And my daughter Lauren, who's going to appear in a minute and say a few words herself, she recorded a little video for him. Bear in mind, she'd never met the guy, didn't know very much about him, but she recorded a video out of respect for him. He watched it. And he replied, and he recorded a video back to her and sent her a little message. And um, she sat at the side of me now. I've given her the news. And to be fair, she took it really well. But what do you want to say, Laura? Well, I didn't really know Chris Travis, but it's, he was really, it, was, it sounded like a really nice guy. Um, I've heard about him lots. Um, I've heard lots about him. I've... I know lots about it, but I've not really seen him. Do you not think it was sad the way that it happened to such a young guy? It was really sad. That, yeah, he, uh, he died really young. The one thing that he said, on when I did the little video interview with him, was that he said he'd see to me. He said, hopefully, you get to see Lauren at a future show. He meant it, and he would have met her. But unfortunately, that's never happened, has it? No, never ever. And I'd love that. I'd, I'd love that to happen, but no, it can't happen now. I'm really sad about that then. So, well, I don't want this to be one of those long drawn out videos, but this is our way of showing our respect to Chris. So, peace out.